Once upon a time, in the depths of the deep blue sea, there lived a curious and adventurous mermaid named Marina. She was unlike the other mermaids, who spent their days combing their long, flowing hair and admiring their iridescent tails. Instead, Marina yearned to explore the world above, to discover the mysteries of the human world. Every night, Marina would swim up to the surface, her sparkling tail glistening in the moonlight, to listen to the stories of sailors and watch the twinkling stars. She marveled at the vastness of the ocean and longed to see the lands beyond the horizon. One fateful evening, Marina spotted a magnificent ship with billowing sails. It was unlike anything she had ever seen. Drawn by her insatiable curiosity, she swam closer, her head breaking the surface. From her hidden vantage point, she observed a grand celebration on board. As the music filled the air, Marina's eyes locked onto a handsome young sailor named Maxwell. His laughter was infectious, and his eyes sparkled like the treasures of the deep. Marina couldn't tear her gaze away from him. She watched as he played his violin, the music sweeping her away on an invisible current. But as the night wore on, the sky grew dark, and the winds turned treacherous. A storm brewed on the horizon, threatening to devour the ship. Panic spread among the crew as they battled the tempest. Marina knew she had to help, so she swam to the surface and used her graceful tail to calm the waves. Maxwell, who had seen her in the moonlight, reached out a hand to her. Marina hesitated for only a moment before taking it. With her help, the storm was tamed and the ship sailed safely through the night. The following morning, the grateful crew rejoiced, unaware of the mermaid's role in their rescue. But Maxwell could not forget the enchanting creature who had saved their lives. He had fallen in love with the mysterious girl from the sea. Marina, too, had fallen for Maxwell, and each night she returned to the surface, hoping to catch a glimpse of him. Their secret meetings continued, and their love deepened with each passing day. But Marina knew that she could never truly be with Maxwell as long as she was a mermaid. She made a difficult decision to seek the help of an ancient sea witch who lived in the darkest depths of the ocean. The witch agreed to grant her legs in exchange for her voice. Marina agreed without hesitation. With legs and newfound determination, Marina made her way to the shore to reunite with Maxwell. But when she arrived, she found that she could not speak, and Maxwell did not recognize her. Heartbroken and unable to communicate her love, Marina's tears fell into the ocean, creating shimmering pearls. In the end, Marina and Maxwell's love transcended words. They learned to communicate through music and the language of the heart. And as they walked hand in hand along the shore, they knew that their love was a treasure more valuable than all the pearls in the sea. And so, the mermaid who once longed to explore the world above found a love that was deeper and more beautiful than she could have ever imagined, reminding us all that true love knows no bounds.